Welcome up to a bit of a chilly start still this morning, not quite as cold as yesterday, and we're going to start to see these changes towards a more uh, rather a warmer forecast along with some slightly higher rain chances as we get into the next several days. Today we're adding on about a 10% chance of a couple showers. You've already seen a few of those across some of our coastal zones. Thursday, Friday, we keep with about that 10% chance for some showers, and then Saturday, Sunday, we start to see this gradually pick up a little bit more as we approach the upcoming weekend. What we are looking at certainly more of the today compared to yesterday is the cloud cover. What a difference 24 hours makes. We had that nice clear blue sky yesterday. Now we have some clouds have been pulled in from the Atlantic thanks to an onshore wind. Within those clouds, we've also seen a couple of showers being produced. They've been pretty spotty and light in nature. We had a few of those out towards plantation just about 15 minutes ago. You can see they're not very long lived and we had a few of those about an hour ago down towards Miami-Dade County. And that's going to be a possibility as we head through the rest of today. The reason being we've got this area of high pressure that's now beginning to shift a little bit off to the east and as it does so that's where we get those winds coming out the northeast back off the ocean and we get afternoons that look like this the cloud cover overhead out across the skyline as we take a look out across Miami from the rusty pelican those temperatures still cool in the upper 60s and low 70s where we've also seen some winds gusting at times last reported wind gusts about 28 miles per hour in Miami with sustained winds that have been ranging today between about 10 to 20 miles per hour so a little bit of a breezy day and a little bit milder as we start to see that area of high pressure build and shift off to the east. This is going to continue to bring us a chance for a stray shower as we into the next several days. As you just saw through Saturday and Sunday, we'll keep with the possibility of a quick moving shower and that warming trend will continue on as well. So for the rest of today, a couple sprinkles will remain the case. The possibility as we head into this afternoon and into this evening, we'll be looking at a cloudier sky for the majority of this afternoon. Maybe some breaks in the cloud deck with some sunshine, but a whole lot more cloud cover compared to what we had yesterday. The sun sets. We still have that low and chance for a few more showers and that will continue even as we head into your Thursday as that onshore flow continues for tomorrow as well. Some changes arriving for Christmas. That area of high pressure is actually going to start to retreat to the northeast and that could be opening up the door for a low pressure system to approach the area with that moisture increasing and being pulled in out ahead of it, which will lead to a chance for at least a few showers come Christmas Day. That chance will continue to increase through Monday. Right now we're putting in about a 30% chance. We still have some uncertainty when it comes to exactly how much rain we're going to see. Thankfully, not looking like anything severe for Monday, but it's not going to be a completely rain free clear day. Nevertheless, still will not be a washout either with those temperatures. They'll be in the upper 70s. Highs today, lower 70s is where we're heading and we're going to be back into this middle 60s overnight, so not quite as cool waking up tomorrow morning. Next seven days, another breezy one for tomorrow. Those rain chances slowly on the rise into the weekend. Those high temperatures will be as well as we should be back into the upper 70s, the high near 78 degrees for Christmas.